Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Gurnita, and today we're going to talk about what medications have a very low risk in patients that remain pregnant and they do have an autoimmune disease. Number one medication is called hydroxychloroquine or plaquenil, and this medication is um, noted to be a very safe medication into rheumatology world. We use it for more than 30, 40 years. It was a medication that was initially used for malaria, but then it was started to use initially for patients with lupus. We do use this medication for patients with Sjogren or patients with rheumatoid arthritis. And um, uh, studies over the years have shown that um, this medication is very safe during pregnancy for the mother and for the fetus. It does not increase the risk of um, complications like um, malformations for the fetus. And it's actually protective for the mother to have less complications from uh, autoimmune diseases. Number two medication is low dose aspirin. This is still a medication that can be used by patients that have an autoimmune disease. If you use 81 milligrams, there are studies that show that um, that will not affect the fetus or the mother during uh, pregnancy. The third medication that can be safely used is Imuran or azathioprine. We use this medication, especially for patients with lupus that can have uh, flare-ups or they have still an active disease when they remain pregnant. And this is again showed that um, <clears throat> has no impact on the mother or the fetus during pregnancy. The fourth medication, this is called sulfasalazine. Although it's not on my preferred list of medication, it does not show to increase the risk for fetal malformations or complications for the mother. I would like to make a disclaimer. Please take this information for educational purposes only and discuss your particular information with your physician when you make the choice to remain pregnant. Thank you very much. I wish you a wonderful day.